night y'all it's time for your butterflies quickies in love with me i am butterfly tarot it is i the butterfly i'm here to do your quick reading uh on how they feel about you for the sign of cancer okay cancer let's jump into this reading um thank you for coming to my channel i appreciate you uh like share subscribe uh to my channel um, if you'd like a reading, my email address is e, it's, it's butterfly, E-Y-E, -E, underscore, A-M, number three, at yahoo.com. Uh, once you subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can get updates on whenever I release uh, new videos. So you can come in and get in and partake on the videos. So I'm doing a general reading on how they feel about you and how you feel about them. And then the energy, three cards each. And then I will call, pull three advice cards at the end. Here we go. because I didn't cut the deck. I'm sorry. Those two flipped out, so I'll let them be. I'm going to go and cut the deck now. If come, sometimes the same card will come back out again. It's so amazing. You go, whoa, that happened. Emperor, okay. All right. Okay. All right, how they see you. Uh, they feel so that you're a controlling person. <laughs> or you're the emperor. I know that's a hard thing to jump to. But it's the, they see that, that uh, you are an emperor. You're the boss, you're a bossy person. <laughs> you like to be in control. Uh, you know how to juggle well. And uh, with the, <laughs> the two swords in reverse, uh, possibly you uh, are ignoring this person. Or, or not, you're, you're, yeah, you're ignoring this person. Um, it looks like they're, I hate to say it, with this two of pentacles that they see you as possibly having someone else and you're ignoring them. Hmm. Why do I say that? Because we have the ten of cups in the reverse. And we have the world card and we have this, this uh, seven of wands. So you see this person as being guarded against you. Okay. And with the ten of cups, this person is completely unhappy with you. Okay. And then you have the world card, which is talking about an ending of a cycle. That there's been an ending between the two of you. So with this uh, emperor card, they see you as a person who takes who who's not, uh, takes uh, no crap, or uh, you're a very controlling individual, very domineering, and also the emperor is a very hypersexual being, not very emotional. He's just hypersexual. So this looks like there's some cheating going on here. Why do I say that? Because the mutual energy is the Queen of Cups, the Ace of Swords, and the Lovers in the Reverse. That, uh, there's a lot of love here. Or you both are trying to seek truth with the Ace of Swords, wanting, wanting somebody to, to bring some clarity. Because there's love here. And this is, I, I have to say that this is you. Because this is your card. This is the Queen of Cups. That's the Ace of Swords. And you have the Lovers in the verse. That's, that's Gemini. Uh, you could be dealing with a Gem Gemini. You could be dealing with an Aries. Um, but it's saying that you want clarity about the relationship. Somebody here was, was fooling around. And 
either you cut them off or they cut you off. There's been an ending here, unfortunately. I don't know how to fix this, y'all. <laughs> oh, goodness. Um, hmm. You're, you know, this person is guarded against you. They, they've cut you off. The cycle has ended. But I see this is your energy, but it's the energy of the both of you. You know, remember, it's a general reading, so the roles can switch. This is how you feel about that. This could be how you feel about that emperor, because the emperor can be like that. He's he's hypersexual, but somebody definitely was juggling. Okay? And now the blindfold is off. It has come to light. And uh, there's clarity. But now you both want to know where you stand on this lover situation. Did somebody make a decision between lovers? Or... Are you using this sword to cut off this lover for good? Uh, that's kind of cut and dry, Cancer. There's definitely been an ending. You know, there was unhappiness, a lack of success. But somebody was juggling. There was a third party energy. And with that lover's in the reverse. And uh, somebody wants clarity on what's going on within a connection. What would they like to tell you? Ooh, how are you going with? What would they like to tell you? Instinct. Uh oh. <clears throat> Follow your natural instinct. You are making uh, the current issue more complicated than it needs to be. Trust in the universe. Allow your intuition to guide you. You are always safe. So trust in your intuition. If you think something's going on, and most likely it is. All right, one more. That must be the card for you. Ooh, one more. The journey. This just stage malfunction. I'll forget it for now. All right, the journey. You are soaring to new heights. Experiment, play. Allow your spirit, uh, spirit the freedom to explore new and exciting possibilities for your life. Follow the rainbow across the horizon. A pot of gold awaits. Oh, it looks like you may have to move on. Trust your instincts. You may have to move on. Okay. Or they may have to move on. It looks like there's a third party situation. Remember the roles can reverse. Uh, you can flip it and script it. What shot fits for whom? <clears throat> New chapter. What did I just say? It's time to move on. Yeah, this uh, situation. It's unrequited love. Even though you may have love there. I just with that, that queen of, of uh, swords there. Oh, not swords. The queen of cups there. And that ace of swords and then that lovers, it's saying that you're cutting this person off and it's time for you to go your own way. That it had come out that there was a third party energy and you guys have decided to end this cycle. So it's time to move on. Okay. All right. Thank you for joining me for my reading. Uh, like, comment, share, subscribe. When you subscribe, hit the notification button so you can get updates on my channel for whenever I release new videos. If you would like to email me, if you would like a personal reading or just want to email me, my email address is butterfly, E-Y-E underscore A-M, uh, the number three at yahoo.com. Thank you for joining me. I appreciate you for coming to my channel and supporting me. Peace, love, and light to you all, okay? Peace and so much love. Thank you. Bye-bye.